Hey there. The knot we're going to talk about today is called a clove hitch. Now it's a good knot for if you want to hang something, maybe from uh, a branch like this or uh, a tree or something. It's useful when you have something that's going to have constant weight hanging down on it. Uh, you don't want to use it for anything that's going to go slacked and then tight again really because it could slip and come loose in there. Uh, one thing it's very useful for is when you're doing lashings. When you're lashing two poles together, uh, you can start and finish with a clove hitch. Uh, and we'll do that in another video. But for this video, I'm just going to show you how to tie a clove hitch. So, and I'm going to use this bigger rope uh, just so you can see a little better. But you could use anything. You could use bank line or paracord. Uh, anything will work for tying a clove hitch. So we're going to take our short end, our tag end here. We're going to go over whatever we're going to tie our clove hitch on to. And then when we come back, we're going to cross, we're going to cross the longer end that we had there. And then when we come back up through, back around this time, we're going to go back under itself here. And now, hopefully what you'll be able to see is my two ends, here's my shorter end, here's my longer end, but both of them are kind of in between here. We kind of make an X and then the ends are coming between these two. And that's kind of how you can tell uh, that you've done it correctly is if you form that X and then your two running ends uh, come out between the parts that you have tied over there. And then like I said, you know, you can pull on this. It's going to stay, but you have to watch because when you release, when it pulls again, uh, there is a chance that it's going to slip and come loose in there. Uh, and I would definitely leave, you know, a little bit of your tag end hanging out. You don't want to get this, you know, up too close or it could pop out from underneath there. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm just gonna run through this uh, as if I'm tying it. Okay, so there you have it, the clove hitch.